Let us have a quick overview of the Zeppelin notebook. What is paragraph and how it can be organized? What are all the features available within it? For this, I am going to use the MySQL interpreter that is bound to this specific notebook. As well as I am going to use the database imported from the MySQL website that is the Shakila database. I am going to use this specific database as a source and the database is organized in this particular form. I have a number of data and the same data have been imported into my database. I am going to use few queries and check how the paragraph as well as the notebook going to work. The moment I create a notebook, this is how I am going to have the page. I have n number of control over here. I can have n number of paragraphs. Paragraphs are nothing but a set of statement. I can have a different type of paragraph. Let me go ahead and create the first paragraph to give a small introduction. So that's MD and it's a markup language where I can provide the help what this particular paragraph going to do. And I can have more instructions. I can create more paragraph one after the other. I can control the settings of this particular paragraph from here. This arrow mark going to execute this particular paragraph or I can use the command shift enter. This would show the editor. If I want to edit, I can edit. And I can hide the editor as well. And the output, if I want to hide, I can hide the output. And uh, the settings for this specific paragraph, I can control from here. If I want to reduce the font, can do all such setup, I can do from here. So that is for the editor. Let me go ahead and uh, edit the setup. Let me hide the output. I'm going to create new paragraph. Since I have made the interpreter, the MySQL as the default interpreter, it should be in a position to connect to the database directly. So I have a database and it is going to give me the output. Like this, I can have n number of paragraphs. I can add more paragraph and by default there will be empty paragraph in the end. And n number of paragraph together, it makes a notebook. And within notebook, I can hide or show the code at the notebook level. That is for all the paragraph and I can show or hide the output at the entire paragraph level. And all the output can be cleared and I can clone this note and create a new copy. As well as I can export this note and provide to other user or I can import it into another Zeppelin environment. I can add more and more versions to this. So let me create first version. I'm going to make some changes. Let me make the font little bigger. Have the output. Can make use. Circular. So I have the third editor. I'm going to execute this. I have four paragraphs. Now, I can go ahead and control the configuration for all these four paragraphs. Now I'm going to create another version. I have four paragraphs. I'm going to add another version. I can check what are all the versions are available within it. If I want to go back to the first version, I can very well go. If I want to use the second version, I can very well go. So the version control is built within the Zeppelin and uh, I can compare the version. So between these two, I'm going to compare the head with the first version. So what was the change and what happened? What are the changes that we have done? We can compare multiple versions and any content type I wanted to search within the code. I can search through this. I can delete the entire notebook. So this is a high level overview on how the notebook is organized and I can create multiple notebook and I can control the notebook by clearing the output or rename, renaming the notebook and deleting the notebook. So that's a quick overview on what are all the controls we have. And in the right side, we have a help on list of shortcuts available to be used with the notebook. And I can control what are all the interpreter bound to this specific notebook. In a, if any interpreter needs to be removed, I can click that and it will get unbound. I can set the permissions for the notebook over here. I can arrange the paragraph by controlling the width. 